Hello guys, welcome to Millionaire by 25. Hope you guys are doing great. Welcome to this lesson. And in this lesson, we will be going into what, in my opinion, I call the best YouTube tool that has ever been made. Now, I'm going to let you know what this tool is and how exactly it can help you tremendously and how it has kept us in growing our channel, our YouTube channel. So the tool is actually called the VidIQ, like I talked about. And the VidIQ is the only paid YouTube tool that we use. A lot of professionals use it also. Now, unlike other YouTube tools, it pulls data directly from YouTube's API, which shows exact search volume results and exact results for competition and other things. Now, take note that VidIQ did not pay us to do this, okay? So you don't think, okay, these guys are promoting VidIQ probably they paid for a promotion no i'm just giving you what would help you so like i said the vidiq pulls data directly from youtube's api which shows exact search volume result and exact result for competition and other things which is going to really help us with our keyword research process now the vidiq offers so much more than any of these other tools out there now i can tell you for a fact that so many of these other youtube tools and softwares don't actually give you valid search results so that's why i recommend the vidiq because like i said it pulls data directly from youtube's actual api now the plan that i recommend using at a minimum for at least one month so you can do this keyword process is the pro plan now the pro plan is only 7.5 $50 a month except it has been reviewed and like I said you only really need this for one month so it will only be a one-time fee of $7.50 just so you can do this keyword process and then if you start any other channel in the future and you want to do this keyword process using VinIQ how I'll teach you then you can get the plan there's also a 39 US dollar a month plan called boost and this is actually the plan that we use in all of our keyword research. And it basically integrates directly within YouTube as well, which makes it super simple for finding the best keywords. And it tells you how to include them in your description, your title and everything. So I can tell you that it is a great tool. Now, obviously $40 a month might be a lot much for you guys, but at a very minimum, I do recommend the pro plan. Now the pro plan lets you do keyword research and that's what I'm going to be teaching which will be telling you exactly how to use vidIQ for doing keyword research. And we're going to actually do this by utilizing the vidIQ which you would need at least four of this method. Now you're going to be needing one of these plans and you are going to need the Google Spreadsheets or either Microsoft Excel. I recommend Google Sheets because of a function I'm going to show you on this video course. And another thing the boost plan also lets you do is add the automatic best keyword. So even if you get the boost plan, it will be able to help you more later by adding these automatic best keywords. But still, I highly recommend doing this keyword process and either of these plans work fine for the process that I am going to be showing you. But the reason that you would need to do this keyword process is because it's only a one-time thing that you have to do on your channel. Now, a lot of us do this on every single channel that we start. So either of these plans work fine for the initial process, but you will need the boost process if you want to add the automatic best keyword on your YouTube videos. And we'll get into that a little bit more. Now, obviously, this is only if you can afford this. After all, a lot of people didn't even have the vidIQ or anything until they had a channel. And some of them had over 50,000 subscribers before they even heard about the vidIQ. But prior to that, they were using softwares like the TubeBuddy. I have used the TubeBuddy before, which I highly do not recommend actually, because like I said, the vidIQ pulls way, way, way more accurate search results. So I highly recommend the vidIQ. And once you are able to afford it, I do highly recommend the Boost plan. Now, you can optimize up to 40 videos a month for the proprietary keyword recommendations, as you can see right here. And a really cool feature is that you can improve existing videos with bulk SEO optimizations, which means 
you can find videos that are performing good for keywords that you haven't even placed on your videos. And then I'll show you those keywords to place in your videos. And this really helps to get views from those suggested trending videos that are related to your content. Now, the biggest thing is it gives you the keyword research. But like I said, you can just use the pro plan for that as well. But I recommend, really recommend getting the boost plan when you can afford it. The main difference of these two plans are, like I said, the keyword engine that finds the best keyword. Now, both include these keyword research and the top trending videos finder as well. And trust me, it is super useful. All you have to do is put a keyword and it will show you the most popular videos that include that keyword in its title. So the top trending videos finder essentially gives you another tab within YouTube. And when you hit that tab and impute a keyword, it will show you the top trending videos either in the last week, the last month or the last year. And that includes that specific keyword that you specified within the video title, which is incredibly useful when you are looking for video ideas and looking for videos to piggyback off. So both plans also include these as well. But the main difference is that the Boost actually has a keyword engine. So you can do the manual keyword research as well, which I highly recommend doing so you can find your best default keywords, which I'll be showing you how to implement here but you can also use their keyword engine, which integrates directly on the YouTube upload page. So when you're uploading a video, it will show you the number one best keywords to add on your video based off the keywords you've already imputed. So it's an incredibly useful tool. Like I said, I highly recommend it when you can afford it. Now here's what the keyword research function within vidIQ looks like. So within vidIQ, if you navigate over the search icon on the top gray bar right there, you're going to want to go to the keyword research option of the vidIQ and then you can simply impute any keyword that you want. As you can see, for example, this person puts butterfly and see what it shows. It found over 205 top keywords related to butterfly and it also spits back all these search results and it shows you a related score, a search volume, a search score, a competition score and overall. Now, the search volume is the exact number of searches that this keyword on average gets per month. Like I said, this is pulling directly from YouTube's API. So these are very accurate search results. The competition score is a score from zero to 100, zero being the least and 100 being the most competition that that keyword has on YouTube. So generally, when it comes to these keywords, the lower, the better. And this only shows the 205 top best keywords related to butterfly. But with the next technique I'm going to be showing you guys, I'm going to show you how to find thousands of related keywords and then sort them from the overall best to worst. Because as you can see, vidIQ also shows you an overall score on the far right of that graph right there. And that's way the competition score against the search volume score. And trust me, 100 would be the best for that and zero would be the least. But I'm going to show you how to copy these keywords into a spreadsheet and use a method that I have discovered to find the best keyword in your niche on YouTube. And this is going to give you guys so much video ideas and it's going to find your overall best keywords that you can implement for your channel keywords and upload the faults that will go on every single video that you upload. So the next video is the most important video within these whole courses. It is the reason most professionals have gotten channels that got over a million subscribers. It is the reason we've had some videos go viral and the reason for so many YouTube success. So I look forward to seeing you guys in the next video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, click on the notification bell icon to get notified when we drop a new video. See you on the next video course.